Hello, my name is Nofatih Atika binti Tajazlan, metric number 280322. For case 3, it's about Mr. DIY. Mr. DIY was established by Tan Yu Ye and Tan Yu Wei in 2005. Since COVID-19 pandemic happened, they encountered hurdles from e-commerce. The problem now is, is it the right decision for the brothers to put more funding on the digitalization and launch their e-commerce platform? And can Mr. DIY succeed with double-edged approach of using both online and offline method? Those problems arise because of firstly, Mr. DIY is maintaining low price strategy while dealing with rising costs and global inflation. Secondly, the explosive growth of e-commerce industry and the importance of digitalization. Mr. DIY should adapt and make changes to their way of selling product as the customer's behavior and preferences is also changing. Lastly, foreign competitors such as Nitori Holdings from Japan Furniture Retailer. Mr. DIY have two decisions to choose, which is either to ignore or to venture into e-commerce. If Mr. DIY choose to ignore, they will miss market expansion, limited access to data and insight, and reduce customer engagement. On the other hand, if Mr. DIY choose to venture into e-commerce, they can expand market reach as they can reach worldwide customer. Their sales and revenue also will significantly increase. Lastly, the e-commerce platform is more convenient to the customer. Customer can purchase Mr. DIY product anytime and anywhere that can generate sales to Mr. DIY continuously. Therefore, Mr. DIY should venture into e-commerce. This is because Mr. DIY can enjoy various advantages as stated before. This also could lead to increasing in their revenue and boost the company's competitiveness and become more customer-oriented. By conducting SWOT analysis, Mr. DIY can gain more understanding of the external and internal factor when they venture into e-commerce. From the analysis, Mr. DIY can see that there are many strengths and opportunities that they can grab to expand their business in e-commerce, such as easy to find and access and global reach. In conclusion, Mr. DIY can expand and succeed their current business with physical and online selling. This allows Mr. DIY to reach broader customer base and generate more revenues as well as following the global technological development.